Hi guys, Mrs. Bagley here. This is part two of our series on spatial awareness. This time we're working on lower body. So what you need is a piece of chalk and painters or masking tape and a balloon. So first, as first comes first, go ahead and draw that, that square on the ground. My daughter is standing inside it. That is basically just giving a visual cue for your son or daughter. Um, to help assist with their spatial awareness. So go ahead, Abby, and bring that balloon in front of Reese. And the first thing you're gonna do is a stationary kick. So you're gonna put the balloon in front and go ahead and let it go, Abby. And Reese, you're gonna step forward and kick. Ready, set, go. Good job. Reese, go ahead back in that square. And the second thing you're gonna do is we're gonna do a drop kick. So your center daughter is gonna have to trap the ball and kick it. And what I love about using a balloon is it's lighter than a ball and easier for them to work with. Like the drop is slower. Okay, Evie, can you drop that ball? And Reese, I want you to kick it to me. Ready, set, go. Kick. Excellent. All right, and the third skill we're gonna do is you're gonna hand the ball to your son or daughter. Go ahead, Evie, and hand that ball, or I'm calling it a ball, the balloon to Reese. And you're gonna drop it and kick it. Ready, set, Go, Reese. Excellent work. So in this series, it's going from easy to hard, and you can do as many repetitions as you want. Um, you can go through each skill one time, or you can stay on one skill if you want to continue to do more of a blocked practice. If your son or daughter needs um, upper extremity assistance or hand, ex hand assistance for this skill, you can have them hold on to, um, like if you stand in a door well, onto the, the door, um, or you know, if you're next to the refrigerator, sometimes the refrigerator handle works pretty well. And then they can work on developing unilateral stance or balance while they're working on spatial awareness. Thanks so much for working with me today and I look forward to seeing you all soon.